Antidepressant tachyphylaxis, more commonly known as poop out, refers to the phenomenon where the effectiveness of a particular antidepressant medication diminishes over time. This can be a frustrating experience for individuals as they seek relief from their symptoms and strive for long-term management of their mental health. Understanding why antidepressant tachyphylaxis occurs requires a closer look at the complex mechanisms behind these medications. When someone starts taking an antidepressant, the drug works by influencing the levels of certain neurotransmitters in the brain, such as serotonin or norepinephrine. These neurotransmitters play a crucial role in regulating mood, emotions, and overall mental well-being. Initially, the medication's impact on these neurotransmitters leads to a noticeable improvement in symptoms, offering hope and relief to those struggling with depression, anxiety, or other mood disorders. However, over time, the brain can develop a tolerance to the specific antidepressant being used. This means that the medication's initial effectiveness diminishes and the person may no longer experience the same level of symptom relief. The exact reasons behind this phenomenon are still not entirely clear and may vary depending on the individual and the specific medication being used. Some researchers believe that changes occur in the brain's receptor systems over time, leading to decreased responsiveness to the medication. Others suggest a phenomenon known as downregulation may be at play, where the brain attempts to compensate for the increased levels of neurotransmitters caused by the medication. It is essential to note that not everyone who takes antidepressants will experience tachyphylaxis. Factors such as genetic predispositions, individual brain chemistry, dosage, and duration of medication use can all influence whether someone will encounter this issue or not. Additionally, certain classes of antidepressants, such as selective serotonin reuptake inhibitors, are more commonly associated with tachyphylaxis than others. When faced with antidepressant tachyphylaxis, managing the situation can be challenging but not impossible. Open communication with a healthcare professional is crucial in such circumstances. They can evaluate the individual's response to the medication, consider alternatives or adjustments in dosage, or explore complementary therapies that may enhance the drug's effectiveness. In some cases, switching to a different class of antidepressants or combining medications may be deemed necessary to regain symptom control. Furthermore, it is important not to discount the value of lifestyle modifications and therapy in managing tachyphylaxis. Adopting a healthy lifestyle routine that includes regular exercise, a balanced diet, stress management techniques, and sufficient sleep can all contribute to overall well-being and potentially aid in reducing symptom recurrence. Additionally, exploring therapy options such as cognitive behavioral therapy can provide individuals with valuable tools and coping mechanisms to navigate their mental health journey effectively. In conclusion, antidepressant tachyphylaxis or poop out can be a frustrating occurrence when seeking long-term management of mental health. It is a complex phenomenon influenced by various factors, including individual biology, medication type, and dosage. However, by maintaining open communication with healthcare professionals, considering alternative treatment options, and incorporating lifestyle modifications and therapy, individuals can overcome this hurdle and continue their path toward improved mental well-being.